beautiful. You so beautifully describe this painting and what it means to me. And your, your followers, I believe, should, you know, understand what inspired you to do this and interpret what this painting, you know, is and the different areas that speak out to you and why they're there. Thank you. Well, first of all, this is called Souls Through Universe. And um, there's this experience that I have um, when I connect to uh, who I am um, in this human experience. And it inspires a lot of my paintings. Like for instance, in this painting here, we have industry. We have this image of this woman looking up at the industrial life versus nature and all the complexities of the thing that things that go on in our lives. And then in this newer piece, you know, not everything needs read. And right now in our country with systemic racism and all the things, we're bleeding black and we don't want to really embrace that and and fix that. And we have these souls that are moving through the universe and we're all connected and then you have this cascade of light coming down through all the chaos and the beauty of it all and you know we have this universe where things are always breaking up and the possibility of things coming towards earth and we're in this infinite reality yet we think with a finite mind and so this is about the expansion and the allowing for um, some of the messes we've made to lead through so that we can heal and continue to expand. And this particular piece, there's a lot of spackling um, material you can see down over in that corner that I've used on the canvas. And then there's uh, different uh, types of paint. There's house paint, spray paint, oil paint, acrylic paint. And it's just put together in, in a story about you know, what it's like to be a human being, a spiritual being, having this human experience. And so a lot of my bigger pieces are talking about the duality, how we, um, how do we stay spiritual and expand and connect authentically and remain present in our societies and our culture and, and stay connected. So that's this world and then over here we have women of color which also expands now into the animal kingdom but again it's about you know having that one eye open in the world and and that unique oneness in the that we each have in our connection with each other and as individuals and then of course i'm always back and grounded to earthly things and you know, pieces like Crow, which are more like the two pieces I explained before. But in the resin pieces, it's always a glimpse into the mind, into how we are in life. Like if you're not looking closely at that piece, you would miss the two lovely little humans sitting in the middle of the universe contemplating life and all the compartments that we have with our mind versus being in the spacious, beautiful reality. Anyway, a glimpse into the way I think about these things. And uh, if you move in a little bit here, you can show uh, some of the textures. It's hard to often get the textures and the pieces, but there's this is a very textured piece. When you try to photograph it, you we often miss all the textures that are in this piece. And you know, then there's this, you know, all kinds of things going on. Anyway, have a good day.